want some money, but you finna hop in. Smoke me, bond like Ben Laden. Decatur Streets. <laughs> edited by Nari Narcotic? Yeah, I did. Yeah, edit that shit too. Alright. That's what's up, bro. What's going on, everybody? Taking L's podcast. Back again for another one. And today, as you heard, we got the boy Nari Narcotic, Narcotic. in the building. Tell the people what's up, man. What it do? Nari Narcotic checking in. Yes, sir. So, um, y'all just saw the, the Jason. That's the name of that? Jason, yes, sir. Jason video. Shot here, edited by you. So, um, for people that I don't know, obviously you do music. Um, what else do you do? You? I do music. I do video editing. I do engineering, mix mastering. Uh, uh, well, I can't get the goddamn graphic design. Mm. Make all that shit. Okay, so Flies, everything, everything art. artists need. I can do that. You can do it for yourself. That's what it's about, man. Twenty twenty one artists. Not that you gotta be necessary to do everything for yourself, but if you can't do everything yourself, you should at least know everybody. Every artist should have their own team. If they can't have a team, you could be your own motherfucking team like Nari. Facts. I see the, um, you say your cousin do merch. Who did the, you got the custom chain? I like that. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. <clears throat> yeah, it's my newest one. Okay. Got and the Nari one. one. What's the, uh, what's the root behind the name Nari Narcotic? Well, my name is Nari, and then Narcotic. That's your actual name. It's short. It's a it's a shorter version of my name. Oh, what's your whole name? Shinari. Oh, that's fine. So that's Shinari. not like an anime character, bro. <laughs> of you got time. an anime character name. Uh, probably Naruto or some shit. Yeah, no, nah, I thought Nari was from like Naruto or some shit. I'm not gonna yeah. find. I thought it was something like that. But basically, Nari is my name. Then narcotic, because narcotic is a is a mind altering substance. But I feel like when I be around a lot of people or walk in certain rooms, the, the whole vibe change. So I mm. feel like me myself. Changes people's minds and moods when I'm around them, so I call myself Nari Narcotic. That's deep. Do you know your um your zodiac sign? Virgo. Virgo. Okay. I don't I was know. Twenty four. I don't know much about Virgo, but you said you. I gotta research that. Change it because I hear like um I'm a Cancer too. And they say that about like changing vibes and shit in the room. So that's deep. So um, how long you been doing music? Since two thousand seven. Oh. Woo. But I wasn't. Like, I wrapped off beat my first song and whatnot. Of back course. In 2007, but yeah. I already know I like music and want to do music. That's what's up. Are you from Atlanta? I was born here. Yeah. I lived in a lot of states, but the time is equal. The time I've been away to the time I've been here is the same. Okay. That's a fact. So, um, taking L's podcast, man, uh, my customary question is like, and it, it don't got to be 2020. It could be just like in life. But um, do you have like a certain L, or like a setback that kind of like, you know what I'm saying, taught you like a big lesson that you turned around that helped you uh, be an artist? A certain L, certain L. Yeah. One time I had lost everything. I'm talking about everything. I'm talking about starving. Like, okay. You're going to be hungry, stomach growling. Yeah. Starving. Yeah. And shit, I just learned perseverance. How to stay positive, how to change all my negative thoughts. Every time I thought of something negative, I just learned how to quickly just knock it out, turn to something positive, and I just came back. So I know, like, at that point, that was my lowest point. So I feel like, shit, nothing can be worse than that. So now everything in life is just easy and smooth. So that was an L that actually turned into a, a W for life. Right. So now you just always good. Built my mind up. Facts. That's, that's what's up, man. I let it hear that you got the right mindset. So, um,. Shit, bro, I see you, like, dripping in. Are you, like, big on the fashion? Like, are you just... I'm not big on fashion, <laughs> but I'm just big on stuff I like. Facts. Like, I'm not a... Like, I'm not a... a, a 
a Fendi, you know, like when I think of fashion, I think of like real fashion, like Saint Laurent stuff like that. I'm more of a like just stay fresh, just yeah, just zoomies, streetwear and shit, shit like that. Facts. Okay, what's the um? You got the what's your your face tag say? Oh, they say Long Live Q. Okay. And that was a close friend of mine who got murdered. Okay. About six years ago now. Yeah. So yeah, and then this right here, this an anarchy. You said it's an anarchy symbol. Yeah, anarchy symbol. Okay. An- anarchy is order. Okay, so you are you are anarchist of sorts. Yeah, some people get it misunderstood though. They think anarchy like you just do whatever or whatever, but it's the A is inside the O because anarchy is order, which means anarchy means no laws or whatever. That means like every day I do whatever I want to do, so that creates an order. So if I do what I want to do, which is probably make music, that's going to give me order to my life because I know everything needs to be in an order so I can make music and do what I want to do every day. Mm. But they look at it like, oh, yeah, anarchy, you're just crazy. You go out here and got them right. doing this. No, I just do what I want, and I make an order out of doing what I want. You don't let the outside world give you the order. Exactly. You make your own order. And people, like you said, yeah, when you make your own order, it can be seen as, like, crazy or, like, <laughs> doing your own thing and being an anarchist. So that's deep. <clears throat> um, you said you got, like, a, 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 a brand. Like, a, not a brand, but a team. Like Bo a, Tough. Okay. It's a label. Okay. Tell LLC. Me, what's, tell me about uh, Bo Tough. Bo Tough is founded by my youngest brother. Okay. But that's the one that made the beat, right? No. This is another brother. He live in Texas. He's not here. Okay. But he make beats too. He fine. But it's founded by him. It's a collective of producers and artists. It started off with just me and my three brothers, the four of us. But now it's like a lot of people, friends and family and stuff like that. It's a label. Right now I'm under them. And shit, we just stick it together, grind it out. Till, okay. Until we make it stand down. What is what does Bow Tough mean? Like what is that? Bow Tough is an acronym, B O T U F for Brothers of the Undead Family. Mm. Undead family. That sound like Dungeon Family or something like that. Yeah, I never yeah. thought about that. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> well, uh, what what's the how what's the meaning behind Undead Family? Undead is like we the undead family. Like you can't kill us. Like no matter what, we undead. Like if we die, we created so many memories and did so much shit. Like it's stuck here forever. So we undead. We a family that's undead. Like I don't have to be here for you to see me. Facts. <laughs> that's deep. That's what's up, man. So um, twenty twenty one. What the people got to look forward to? I got a smash single. Mm. I'm I'm speaking to this. I'm saying smash, even though it's not out yet. Smash single. Me and Corny Cash. That song called All Her Life coming out, and then I got an album. I'm about to put out. It's going to be the longest one I ever put out. I usually stick to like 9 or 10 songs. I think I'm going to do like 18, 20 songs on this one. Okay. It's going to be on all platforms? or All Spotify? platforms. Okay. Everywhere. Spotify, Apple Music, YouTube. Wherever you wherever you type in, whatever app you got or even don't have, it's going to be on it. Okay. <laughs> what, um, what advice would you give to like artists that come up? Shit. Don't listen to nobody. That's the main thing. I, my my main advice is don't listen to nobody, uh, and always follow your intuition, cause that's what I do. You may not know what you're doing or where you're going. Just just listen to yourself. It's always it's always well. At least for me, I can't say very much, but it always work out. Just mm. some may say I don't know. Just do it. <laughs> that's what's up, man. Yeah, that's uh, that's pretty deep. I didn't really know you before the interview, but um, we got a, a lot of the same. Ideas and principles, man. Okay. So that's that's what's up. I'm glad we linked up. Yes, sir. Um, yeah, bro. I don't really. I feel like that was kind of short. Like. <laughs> yeah, I mean. <laughs> like we could, we could. Um. Maybe if I was smoking a blunt, been longer because I yeah. would have been putting them thoughts in my head. I know. Right? I was like, usually you pass it back and forth and shit. <laughs> I'm like, I already got that question. How, how long was that? That was, was a cool ten. ten. Yeah. <laughs> we could just goddamn kick it. Yeah. You, you, try, you, you could throw another. Good parts you could throw another song on, really. <clears throat> I probably okay. think it's some more shit. Yeah, I'm throwing another one on. Mm-hmm. Let me play that. Like, uh, I'm gonna play something from uh, my last, my very last project. It was called Spooky Narcotic. It's called Spooky Narcotic because it dropped on Halloween. Okay. And that's where this Jason concept come from. Mm-hmm. Trying to get spooky and shit. Okay.
Smoke on Gab, my island Asian. And it was only four songs. It was an EP. But, uh, let's play his inches real quick. Everybody like that pretend. Stream NCAA March Madness. Live. YouTube TV. Oh, it's This one I said, like when I heard this shit, my brother, I know we probably make some pops for this show. You know what I mean? Even if I got it, you know, pay for your time for that. You know what I mean? For sure. Or, um, do you have like any like people you say are like inspirations in music? I ain't gonna lie. Yeah, yeah. I feel like right, this shit sound crazy. I feel like Future might be God. <laughs> <laughs> I, I totally, I, I know what you mean. And then when I listen to the game, like, I can't say people steal his style, but they trace his flow. Certain flows, like, Certain songs I could literally hear. You could play one of his songs, maybe the same. All they do is just change the words and use the same rhyme scheme. If I can hear, I'm like, oh, ain't this future shit? Yeah. Then I play a song like the same as that flow. Like, she was crazy. Yeah, future definitely gave a lot of people, myself included, like. It's like a, he just gave like a whole new base to hip hop, right? Right. And R and B. Yeah. That's the crazy part about it. Yeah. I be listening to R and B. I be like, shit crazy. Like, can't really make wrong. Oh, you hear something crazy? Yeah. Corona over, right? Yeah. On TikTok, Mask Off gonna be the number one song, and then you gonna see what they call the future. That's a prediction. <laughs> we got it on camera. What? <laughs> what? All right, let's see. What? Everybody's gonna be talking about Mask Off on TikTok, and Instagram, Reels, all that. Watch. All right. Soon as Corona over, with, Mask Off. Fuck. Watch. All right, we got it. We got it. We gonna get a whole nother check. Heard it here first. Got a check for. Yeah. That's crazy. Cause I've been thinking about Mask Off during the, but it's it's the opposite. You're right. But, but yeah, when that shit's when that's done, it's, they got the, they got it off in Texas. I heard, so it hasn't. Um, but that's only one state. So all right, watch when they go when they go global, not global, but yeah, America. America, why? Thanks. I don't think I'm wrong, but I could be. <laughs> hey man, I, I, I can see. So I'm gonna have to be the first person to do it. If it start taking too long, yeah. my fuck it. Mask off, mask TikTok. Off. Take Damn. my mask off, shit. Yeah, <laughs> Everybody been telling me this their favorite one off the tape.
talk more. Okay, what's up? What's up? Where do you see yourself in five years? In five years? Or do you even I, look that far out? I look past that. Mm. But so, in five years, every goal accomplished. Mm. What are those goals? Goals is notoriety. Let me say I'm not saying fame, because I don't mean fame. Notoriety for what I do. With basically, I want everybody to know. Anybody who see me need to know me for what I do. Not be like, oh, that's bro. No, that's the dude who do such and such. Who make who who make the music. Who do the da 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 da. da. Every time you look at me, I just want that to be on me. Right. I want no, notoriety for what I do. I'm not gonna bring the money into it because that's that go. That's 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 of course. Yeah. But that and really just. Me and my brother just being where we predicted ourselves to be, which is just shit. Art, uh, known, known artists just doing what we love. I want to say getting paid for what we do, but you know, when you put music out on platforms, of course you get paid for what you do. Right. But I mean, just everybody just knowing us for that. Thanks. And I know my goal, because right now where I'm at, really it surprised me. Not surprising, like, not the progress, but how the progress happened. Like, yeah. how the steps just, like, just stepped up. Like, everything lined up accordingly, like, on time. So, I was just, I'm just keep doing what I'm doing. I don't know if that really answered the question. No, nah, it did. Yeah. It answered the question. <laughs> That's what's up. So, Because um, me, I'm like, I want to be global, like the whole, yeah. but I don't have to be global to yeah. me to be successful. Yeah. I mean, okay. Matter of fact, answer my question. All 50 states. Yeah. I need to be known in all 50 states. And I'm happy with that. I don't even got to go outside the country. All 50 states is notoriety for what I do. Facts. Do you think you need a label to do that? Or you can, can you do that independently? Don't need a label to do that. Okay. But I would get, with a, besides my brother, I would get with an outside label only because sometimes you don't want to do everything yourself. Sometimes you rather just let your check go to somebody else so they handle all your business. Right. That, that's that's really the only reason why I was signed to a label. Just because I just want to sit back and only rap. I don't want to worry about keeping track of this royalty or keeping uh, or mixing and mastering or setting up my video shoots. I don't want to do that. So I would get with a label to handle all my shit for me. Thanks. But you you can um you can kind of build that that same structure. With your team. Yeah, with your team. It's good. Not having a label. But they got to have their interest, though. That's the only thing. Yeah. If they're not interested, they just want to be a producer, or then you still got to yeah. find it within yourself or go outside. Thanks. You want to shout anybody out specifically from your team? Any producers or anybody? I want to shout out Groovy Mizza. Best producer in Atlanta, in my opinion, and probably all opinions, too. I also want to shout out Just Call Me Vito. That's a real one. 100, A1. You know what I want to shout out? My brother Jody and my nigga Nori 1K. Realest niggas I ever met. I'm not just saying it. Because they're my brothers. <laughs> and I'm going to shout you out. Thanks. Matter of fact, St. Uno got a song called Articulate. And I've been having that motherfucker on goddamn wham. Facts. I appreciate <laughs> that, bro. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. All right. Well, yeah, we're going to end it on that, man. All right. I appreciate your time, man. I appreciate you coming through. And, uh, yeah, man, it's taking out this podcast. Catch y'all later, bro. <laughs> Thanks. It's lit, bro. That was smooth. Yeah, that was cool. It was smooth, man. Sometimes I'll be having a little anxiety. <laughs> <laughs> hey, you should keep that on there. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, keep it on there. Let me hit that dope. 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 Let me hit that dough. Let me hit that dough. Let me hit that dough. Smoke. I need it. I really need it.